Hey guys, welcome back. So today we have an all day clean with me. So starting in the morning all the way till the night, I'm gonna be transforming my entire upstairs because it has been neglected for a long time. I need some real clean today. So all the bedrooms, all the bathrooms are gonna get deep clean along with organizing a ton of laundry. So if you guys would like to see this huge transformation, just keep on watching. You know that I'ma keep it cool With you I feel like breaking rules On the edge looking out with no parachute You know I'm dreaming about us who Playing around without a clue On the edge cleaning out With us it's all or nothing Okay, so first I'm gonna start off in my bedroom. So all of our sheets and blankets are all due for a wash. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw that in right now. But you guys, this is currently what my laundry room is looking like. I have a ton of laundry to do. So it's just gonna be back to back to back of loads of laundry. Look at Ezra over there. He made a little spaceship. That's my car. Oh, it's your car. He was using my bed, but then we switched him on over to the bassinet. So it definitely has been a while since I've cleaned under the bed. So I thought it was perfect timing. This was supposed to be in my spring clean, but I am kind of late to the game, but it's okay. When, whenever you feel like you gotta do it, you should just do it. So that is what I'm doing right now. So what's cool about cleaning underneath the bed is that you find your long lost treasures. I found some jewelry. My favorite hair clips were all under here. So I just fished those out and whatever was left, I just threw away.
it's been a while since I vacuumed upstairs, so I feel like it just needed a little extra kick. So I'm using some of this vacuum powder. This stuff smells so good. And I love to use this on special occasions. I know it's not totally great for your vacuum, but it just leaves the room smelling so good and it lingers for a while. So moving on to my bathroom, I just started by taking everything off of the countertop so that way I can start spraying it down with some scrubbing bubbles, a rag with hot water and I just rinse away. But what I really want to focus on in my bathroom today is organizing the drawers. Even though they're slightly organized already, I do want to reorganize it and declutter a lot of things because in certain drawers, I just don't use a lot of the products and I feel like it's wasting space. So that is what I'm going to work on today. I've got sunshine, I've got you now When we're body and body, oh, body and body, oh, body and body, oh, body and body I know love now, and you're stuck in my mind When we're body and body, oh, body and body, oh, body and body, oh, body and body So Emma's room is pretty messy. We're gonna go ahead and give it some TLC a little bit later, but first I'm gonna put to wash all of her sheets and blankets. So now that my bedroom is pretty much taken care of, I'm gonna start moving on to M's room. And I noticed that her mattress needed to be washed too, like the cover of it. So I went ahead and threw that in. A long way down to the same old song. Now I'm gonna start organizing all of her drawers or reorganizing it. So as you guys can tell, there is a little system going on here, but throughout the weeks, you know, things just don't get put away in the right spot. So I'm just kind of putting it back in its original home. And then after that, I'm just going through all of her other drawers to take out whatever doesn't fit her anymore. A lot of the jean shorts don't fit her, unfortunately. So I'm gonna go ahead and put those in a pile so that way Amber can wear them eventually. Problems and nights. I know it's sad, but 
So now for the girls a closet I'm gonna go ahead and just like hang up a lot of the stuff that kind of just got shoved underneath the closet and it kind of got unorganized too like all long sleeves and hoodies are at the bottom and all the short sleeves and dresses and stuff like that I put at the top so I'm basically just trying to make it look neat again <laughs> So now I'm back in my bathroom because I didn't get a chance to clean out the shower and that is something I really wanted to do because it is pretty bad. I have a lot of old containers, there's a lot of like soap residue so it just needs a good cleaning. So I'll be using some of this scrubbing bubbles foaming cleaner and I just sprayed it all over and let it sit for a while and now I'm gonna take my electric spin brush and just start scrubbing away. All 
right guys so lastly but certainly not least is my kids bathroom and this bathroom has gotten so bad to the point where I actually had locked it so they wouldn't use it and they would just use the other clean bathrooms in the house because it was that dirty and cluttered so but i'm gonna go ahead and fix that today we are gonna give this bathroom a complete transformation so i went through all of the products that were on my shelf and only put out my favorites that we use on a daily basis just so it's easy access and it just looks a little bit more neater and then after that i went ahead and just reorganized refolded this linen closet because everything was just thrown everywhere <laughs> And that is pretty much it for today's video. After this, I took a good shower and I went to sleep right away because it was super late. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you're not already, click that subscribe button down below and ring the bell to get notified every single time I upload a new video. Thank you guys for watching and I'll talk to you in the next one.